I'm John and welcome to this video. I want to take this opportunity to show off a part of my hometown, Utrecht in the Netherlands. I will just skip the standard touristy bits and show off things I find interesting about Utrecht. This building here is the old FC Utrecht Stadium. As you might have known, this football club has gone bankrupt a few years ago. At the moment, the building is leased to a few businesses and a church. The Utrecht Initiative holds regular open-air church here. It's quite amazing to be in church with thousands of others. Sadly, I was not able to film inside because of copyrights. The local government wants to demolish the stadium to build affordable housing. I have not voted for these parties. Let's proceed to the university campus, as I want to show off my old house. We will just follow the recently abandoned train track. This train used to carry passengers to the university campus. As funding ceased, the track fell in disrepair. Some parts have been converted to bus use, other parts left to rust. The problem here, the buses are privately owned and cost an arm and a leg. It's unaffordable for the average Joe to take public transport. This forces students to cycle and might not even be a bad thing. As it's near, I would like to show you this incredible piece of engineering, the Krommerijn. It's called the Krommerijn because it's almost a straight line from Utrecht to Amsterdam and built by Napoleon. Let's continue and follow the road to the university campus. I've got some fond memories of this location as I used to live in the student complex to the right. They kicked me out because my grades were not high enough. This is getting more and more common here in the Netherlands. Education just for the elite. Either get top tier grades or pay a premium in student housing. To illustrate my point, this building here is a spark, as in spark of genius. It's owned by the Hogeschool, that translates to high school, but it's in fact above university. As they say it, it's here to attract the best of the best. Making Utrecht more attractive for everyone with at least a second PhD. I hope you found this interesting and learned something. Thank you for watching, have a nice Easter and see you around.